Hey everybody, it's Kate from Wild Tales of Kate Bergen in Georgia today. Yeah. And what's the holiday today, guys? Martin Luther King Day. Yeah, so today is Martin Luther King Day, and the kids have the day off from school, as I think most kids would. So one of the things that's always suggested on this day is to do a service project. And a lot of that is kind of difficult with COVID and then ones that are available, there's a lot of age restrictions. So a lot of times the kids need to be a little bit older to participate in some of the projects. So we decided to do one just on our own. So we are on our way actually to a Martin Luther King March that is here at our local high school and so we thought it's about a mile to get there from our house and so we are we got our trash picker we got our trash bag and we got our awesome kids and so we we're just picking up trash along the way and making our way to the march and so we thought we would share this day with you picking up trash encouraging you to do the same in your community on any day, it doesn't necessarily have to be on a particular holiday, and just show you what our Martin Luther King Commemoration Day is like here in Seattle.
Raise your hand if you like Ferris wheels. You like Ferris wheels? Yeah. Yeah? Oh, there's a cat. Oh, yeah. It's a cormorant. 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 They're those ones that perch and they, they look like they're drying their wings. Checking the Kraken score. It's the shootouts. Are we gonna finally win after 10 times? No, nine. Nine? No, is it's it nine? 10. I think yeah, I, I think this is the 10th game in a row. And the shootout. Three, two, winner. Finally! Finally win. <sighs> These are the last standing houses of downtown Seattle, right here. And this is where we're standing is a pea patch, which if you're not a Seattle person, that is a community garden. We call them pea patches. It's pretty cool. So I was just telling Slade that when we were in the Martin Luther King march, we were marching with the one of the buskers of the Pike Place Market. I was kind of we saw. He is the man who plays the piano on this corner. I give him a dollar. And here he is. Downtown. The march ended at City Hall and then, which happens to be not too far from Slade's office. So Slade met up with us and since we didn't think that the kids walked enough already, which was three hours, just kidding, we decided to wander down the waterfront and checked out the Olympic Sculpture Park and then now we are heading back down through the Pike Place Market and back through downtown. So, thanks so much for joining us on mostly our Martin Luther King Day adventure. Hope you enjoyed following along, seeing what it's like and how we honored Martin Luther King here in Seattle. And if you did something special with the service project, we would love to know about that. So make sure to leave a comment below about what you might've been up to on this day. If you enjoyed our video, we'd love for you to give us a thumbs up Thanks so much for watching and we'd love, of course, love for you to subscribe if you want to join us on all our adventures. And I think we can log this. I, I'm thinking this may have been our longest walking day of 2022. If you don't know, we are trying to log 1,000 hours walking in this year as a family. And so pretty sure that was a five hour day, which is huge. So. Thanks again. Hope you're staying happy and healthy and we hope you are getting out and having some brave wild adventures and we'll see you next time.